Hello, my friends. How are we doing today? As you can see, we are playing some aground. This is going to be the first episode in my aground series. Obviously, I do have the introduction to aground where I recommend you come and play it. But today, we are actually diving into the game. So let's go ahead and get started. All right. So the first thing we want to do is we want to do a new game. And we're going to go right here to the empty slot. And as you can see, you can customize your character. So we can do skin color. Uh, let's do something that is similar to me. A furry monster. Uh, either that one or maybe that. Mm, maybe maybe three. I think that looks good. But you know what? We'll worry about that later. Uh, hairstyle. All right, let's see. Oh, I could be bald. Oh, uh, that's funny. Uh, you know what? <laughs> I kind of like that one. I mean, wait. Let's see what I get. No. Uh, that one's pretty cool, but I think I'm going to go back to, uh, to that one right there. Eye colors. Well, you may not be able to tell by looking at me, but I do have blue eyes. See? And let's uh, see if we have blue as an option. Yellow. Brown. Purple. Ooh, red. Holy smokes. That's scary. Hmm. That's a tough choice. I think I'm going to go with that one. <laughs> okay, I think we're all set. Is that everything? Yes, that is all the options. Okay, so now that we have our character built in this awesome game, we're going to click OK. Kind of looks like me. Kind of. Oh boy. Oh boy. What's happening? Excitement. Okay, it looks like I'm underwater and there's a boat above me. Yes, we are in water. Big crash of some sort. Ooh. We are floating up to a mysterious island, and we are climbing. We've run aground, guys. So cold and tired, I need shelter, but there's nothing around here but fallen branches. Oh, man. My goodness, that was loud. Wow, I'm going to have to turn my volume down. Uh, what do I do here? Do I just hit an arrow? Enter? Okay, yes. I have to enter. Oops, I pressed enter. I have to try building a hut. Eight wood should suffice. Enter. Okay, so left and right arrow keys move me. ASD also moves me. Left and right, okay. Gotcha. Press Z to collect wood. Nice. New item discovered. Wood. I like it. Wood. That's three wood. Wait. Pick, beer. pick, pick berries. Z. Found berries. This is great. I can barely hold this wood. My stamina will go down faster now, but I almost have enough wood to build a hut. Oh, that's great. Okay, press enter. Z. Berries. Ooh, these berries look very helpful. I wonder. Berries. They're red. They're not purple. Oh, I'm overcarrying. I wonder what that means. I bet you I'm going to be in trouble soon. Overcarrying capacity. Can I do anything with that tree? No. Okay. Here's more wood. Berries. I wonder if they'll let me keep them carrying stuff. Okay. Oh, look, I'm sweating. I'm sweating. This is great. The rat? Can I do anything with the rat? Nothing. Okay, I got all this wood. Oh, what's this? Not bad for my first shelter. Okay, so I must have gotten all my eight wood. Great. Help! Please, shelter. Someone's outside. Can I trust them? Uh, guys, you definitely want to say yes to this, because if you don't, and I'll tell you in a moment, let's do this, yes. Thank you. I owe you my life, but what do we do now? For now, we stay warm and dry. But what about after that? How will we survive on this deserted island? Is there even any point? We're stuck here. There's no going back. At least we can try. Maybe life here won't be as bad as you think it'll be. Huh. All right, so day one is over. We have a hut. That guy is asking some questions over here. Uh, before we start, though, is when, the, when people knock on your hut door, make sure you allow them to come in because each guy, as you progress through this game, uh, is going to make you have abilities to build certain things. And if you say no, you can't go back. You essentially lose out on that ability. So make sure you say yes to everybody that comes in. Um, 
that's my my recommendation because I I think this is the fellow I said no to first uh, when I first started playing this game and I wasn't able to build a kitchen. I think he's the one that allows me to build a kitchen. So make sure you say yes to those people. Okay, let's see what we have here. Press Z to talk. You really expect to be able to survive here? It's hopeless, man. Okay, this guy's a very downer guy. Uh, you're good at building, right? What if we build something to store the resources and food we gather? Hmm, I guess with eight wood and four berries, I might be able to make a decent storehouse. Okay, sounds great. So we have a new quest. The builder, oh, this is a builder. Okay, he wants you to build a storehouse. Requirements, eight wood and four berries. We have zero wood and two berries. All right, let's do it. All right, I can find that, no problem. That's right, that's the spirit. Take this stone axe if you're so gung-ho. We have a stone axe. Let's do it, guys. Oh, and look down there, shortcut key C. And we can hold, oh, I missed. <laughs> I didn't mean to hit you, mister. I'm so sorry. All right, let's uh, see if we can gather these. There's berries right there, pick berries. Got those. Chop a tree with my stone axe now. There we go. Oh, yes, and I got apples and four wood. That was great. Pick berries. I think we might be already there. Let's see. I just have to chop some more trees, I think. Let's see. Uh, we need to chop the tree by pressing Z. Oh, I can hold it. Okay, this is great. I got eggs. I don't know how eggs come out of tree. Oh, you know what? Probably from the birds flying by. I bet that's what it is. I bet that's uh, the birds had a, a nest up there. Z for my berries. Here's some more wood. All right, so this is pretty neat. We're collecting it. Uh, there's a rat there. I'll cut another tree. Oh, I leveled up. Max health, skill points. Okay, I got you. All right, so I got to keep on earning skill points. I have four. I need four out of ten. All right, all right, all right. I see what you mean. Nice. Okay. Well, our skill is increasing. Oh, we should definitely have enough stuff now. He says I'm over-carrying. Can I run? I'm sure there's a run button somewhere in here. We'll come back to his berries. Let's go talk to the uh, builder. Hello, builder. You gathered everything already? I'm impressed. That's right, guys. We don't sit around doing nothing. We get to work when we run aground. Hey, right, let's get this uh, storehouse built. Infinite space. Build a storehouse. Look at that. Don't you feel accomplished? Oh, I sure do. That thing is massive, and we have infinite space now to store our stuff. This is great. Yeah, actually, this will be useful. Now we can avoid getting tired from carrying too much. We can quickly drop off all that extra weight by using the move all button and use Q to toggle starred items. Starred items will stay in your inventory when you hit move all. Hmm. All right. Well, let's see what's in the storehouse. Well, you know what? Let's let's move all. Okay. How many would like to store? We'll do that. Okay. I'll we'll just hit enter on that. Okay. All right, we moved everything over for now. That's great. And I guess I could probably hit the X button to exit out of here. Okay, yep, so we don't have to constantly use the mouse. That's great. Great controls here. Um, hey, where did you come from? I'll talk to you. Oh, hey, didn't realize there were other survivors. Oh, you must have been on the ship. I've been underground. <laughs> yeah, I could tell. There's way more to this place than meets the eye. I've got an extra pickaxe if you want to check it out, too. Oh my gosh, these people are so helpful. I'll take it. Well, what are you waiting for? Just hit the down button to dig down and find those ores. Hey! There's our ores, guys. This is great. Alrighty, I discovered coal. So yeah, this game is uh, a little bit like uh, Minecraft and uh, a little bit like Terraria. Uh, it's really interesting. I, I really do enjoy this game quite a bit. And let's see how far down we can go here. There's more coal. We'll go gather that real quick. This is pretty neat.
Oh, and it looks like the builder is adding wood to my... Ooh, we have 14 skill points. That's great. We leveled up. Okay, so we have 18 out of 24. I guess uh, maybe we should update our stamina. Can we update it even more? Four. All right, that's good. That takes eight. That takes six. Six, 20, 30, 50, 50. These all take a lot of skill points. Okay. Well, we'll just keep on working towards what we're doing. Okay, so yeah, if you look down in the left-hand side there, you see my health. And that little green bar is our stamina. So as we move and carry stuff, our stamina starts going down quicker and quicker. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't know what those are, but they look bad. I'm going to go up here. <laughs> I don't think I'm ready for that just yet. Miner added coal. Talk. I'm exhausted. You look tired too. We should rest in the hut to save the game and restore our stamina. Oh, that sounds like a great idea. Let's go do that. So we'll go to the hut. Rest in the hut. So when I arrived here, I just started digging and didn't re even realize there was a storm. But I'm glad you're here. I was getting tired of eating dirt. And there's nothing like a warm fire after a long day underground. So wait a minute. You didn't even know there was a storm, and you were underground, and a storm happened, but you got here. So you didn't crash in the storm? Do you think there are more survivors out there? Honestly, I'm surprised anyone survived that crash, but here we are, so maybe others survived too. Hmm, uh, that would be logical. All right, so the game has been saved. We have full stamina again. Let's see what she has to say. How's the digging going? Maybe we should build a smelter to melt down ores into bar. That's a great idea. What do I need to do? I need 15 coal, and I already have 10. Hey, this is great. I'll accept it. Great. Let me know when you have enough coal. Will do. We're going down for some coal, guys. Oh, I see some. So that's 11 coal. There's 12 coal. I'm over carrying. 13 coal. 14 coal. I need one more coal. Come on. One more coal. My stamina's going down fast. Look at that. Oh, and it's slower now. I'm slower at mining. There's 15, but I'm really slow. And I'm sweating. All right, come on. You can make it up there. See my stamina going down. We should be able to make it, though. Um, I don't know if I want to rest in the hut, but first we'll get rid of this coal by talking to this person here. This is the stuff. I should have a smelter up in no time. Ooh, another achievement. The smelter can turn raw ores into bars. It requires fuel to melt them down, but luckily there is plenty of coal around to keep it running. Hmm. Oh, more experience port. Skill points, great. Um, Weight increases the base carrying capacity. Yeah, I definitely want to do that. That will help me move quicker. All right, I'm not enough to upgrade any further than that, so we'll just do okay. Oh, critical hit. I think that hurt. That hurts. Yes, that hurts. Okay. Stop hitting me. Oh, oh, I did something. Hold on, come back. It's an axe. I got you. Oh, I got you again. Oh, I got you again. Ooh. Instant meat. <laughs> New item discovered meat. That's great. Okay, so we have a smelter. Can I smelt some ores? All right, let's do it. How many would you like to use? Um, I guess one. That's what it'll allow me to use. A little confused here. We'll figure it all out. Quests. Craft a smelter, build a storehouse, build a hut. We did all these quests. Okay, so we're good on those. Um, you can also use hotkeys now. Hit one, two, three, or four in the inventory window to set them. Okay, thank you. I'm going to gather some more coal. What's this? Iron ore? 
That's great. I bet you this is like a... Ah! Ah! Get away from me. Get away from me. Oh, he's killing me. Oh, he takes away six. They're strong. Like a grub. It's very dark down here. really see my health is low and my stamina is really getting down all right so let's go up here and get some more coal oh good they're doing work for me down there too you see that over carrying capacity okay um we'll come back for you guys let's get back to the surface here Apples were stolen from the storehouse. What? So stuff can get stolen from my storehouse? That's not good. Alright, let's sleep and uh, save the game and get some stamina back up. Oh, that's all you have to do now. It doesn't take anything. You just press up, and it saves it and gives you stamina. So that's nice. I do need health, though. Maybe, um... Hey, are you new? You look new. Boy, am I glad to see you, Shiny. Here, I was thinking I was all alone. Just one old man in an empty world. I still got some life in these old bones, and I reckon I could help you out. Farming's my trade, and we all need some good food to keep us going. Ooh, we have a farmer here. How about we build a barn and get a farm up and running? <laughs> well, that sounds like a plan to me. You need 11... Oh, we need 15 wood. We only need four more. I'm going to accept that. Of course. How could I not? We'll chop down this tree. And that should be all the wood I need. All righty. Looks like you're ready. Wow, these missions are easy. Nice. I'll put up the barn and plant some wheat seeds. <laughs> Share cropping. Now we have a farm. Stop by on occasion to pick up growing crops. That will help restore your stamina. Here, take some bread to keep you going while it grows. I will. Thank you, sir. Do you have something else to say to me? There are a lot of apples around here. With enough seeds, I could probably plant a nice orchard. Orchard. <laughs> Ignore my reading abilities. <laughs> All right, sounds like that's a plan. Apple time. Aha, I got you. Oh, you coming to attack me? Oh, no, you don't. Where's my axe at? Why is my axe not hitting him? All right, back up. Why is my axe not doing it? Oh, I'm in the wrong one. Aha! Aha! Oh, boy. Run! Run, Dexter! He's going to kill you! Faster! Oh gosh, there's one there. He's running from me, though. Sleep! Oh. Now, I bet you youngins are thinking this here's the end of the world. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. But I thought the same during World War III. And yet, here we are. World War III, so this is taking place in the future. <gasps> the way I see it's... We just got to make the best of the situation and be glad there's food to eat and company to share. But how long will we have to live on this God forsaken? I oh, I'm, I'm talking like the wrong guy. It's the guy over there on that side. Oh, well. Who knows? Oh, wait. Who knows? But <laughs> who knows? But as long as there's life, there's hope. Perhaps in time, this island will be as good as home. Huh. Well, that's interesting. Uh, so I guess we have to gather some apples. And, um, hmm, we can build an orchard. So what I think uh, you guys should do is leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of this game so far. And in the meantime, if you want to help me gather some apples or at least watch me gather some apples, go ahead and click on that video over there to continue watching. All right, I'll see you in the next one, guys. 
Have a great day. Bye. <laughs> oh, yeah, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Hey, you made it this far in the video. Obviously, enjoy what you're watching. So why not? Either that or you left your device on. Hmm. Yeah.